Hi, how to batch print PDF files to a printer that supports PDF natively. Now to check your printer first, just open the brochure for your printer or the PDF what you can find online. Um, also if you look at the driver setup as well, you'll see for example I've got a Xerox VersaLink here. I've got a brochure what I've downloaded. If you look for page description languages, you'll see then what all the file types it supports natively. So it doesn't need to go through software first or a driver first before it gets to the printer. So you can print to it directly. So in this case, it's got PCL, which is quite normal. Postscript is quite normal. In this case, it's got PDF, and that's what I'm looking for. So you can print PDFs natively. So I don't need a Adobe Reader or anything like that. I can just send PDFs straight to the printer. Now to do this, we have a software tool called Batch and Print Pro. So what you do is you put in your files in the list. Then you set your printer, file printer setup. Okay. And then you send it natively. Because normally it would print via Adobe or internally rendering. So you go into options menu, general setup options, and then you click on printing and you'll see a list of what can be printed raw to the actual printer. So I want to print PDFs raw, so I just click that box there. Save and exit. So now I can just click print as normal. When you look at the printer, it has sent those files natively. You can change the uh, file naming for the spool file as well. Just delete those and I'll show you that. Options menu, general setup options. Tick that box at the top. So it just uses file title. So print that again. So those are now natively being sent to the printer. So there's no software in between. And that's how you do it. So if you right mouse properties there. You can see that it's a Xerox V5 print. Right, it won't show the number of pages because it can't work it out. Now, if you just want to print all the PDF files, say as one file, you can do that also. Print PDFs as one file. Click print. What it'll do, I append them all together and create a temp file and print it out as one. And that will be sent natively as well. With native, you can always tell because the pages is NA, so you can't calculate it. And that's it. Give it a try.